Hello and welcome back to the Craft Box. My name is Brent, and today I'm going over my top five um, updates for Pirate 101 that I want to see. I'm just going to preface this video first by saying there is no worlds in this list. Um, obviously, everybody wants a world. I know that. Kings, I'll definitely know that. Um, so these are things other than worlds that I would like to see. Number five, Photomancy. If you're familiar with Wizard 101, you probably know there is a feature for taking screenshots in the game called Photomancy. By pressing a hotkey, you get a menu which allows you to hide your player, other players, pets, um, which allows you to take some awesome photos of the areas, or you can take an epic selfie like this <laughs> to show all of your friends your new stitch or whatever you want to show them. There is also a timer feature which is useful for hosting big group event photo shoots. But the best thing is that you can add stickers and text to the photos and add an extra touch to your screenshots. I honestly think that this feature would be a great addition as it makes it easier for players to share their favorite moments with all their friends or keep it for yourself if you prefer to solo life. Number four, fishing. Imagine this, getting on your ship, heading to a remote spot in the skyway and catching fish. I would love to see fishing added. It seems like a natural fit for the game. We can join the ranks of the fisherbirds of Jonah Town and cast out a line and catch some legendary fish. I propose fishing to be an activity that you can go at alone or with some friends. There would be spots around every skyway where fish lurk. However, these will change throughout the day, so you will have to keep moving around to catch fish. I mentioned teaming up with groups. Well, what if there was a super fish boss that spawned in one of the skyways that would require more than one fisher to catch? Maybe a mega storm shark lurking in the trade wind skyway? You would as a team have to wear out the fish to make it easier to catch. Not by normal fighting however, but by playing a strategic minigame using your companions and friends to try and trap the fish and catch it. I'm thinking a tower defense-esque minigame where each companion has a special ability to help slow the fish and bring it into your ship. But what would fishing be without rewards? I think you should be able to hand your fish in to Captain Ahab to receive powerful doubloons and gear to help in your fights. Number 3. Crafting. Crafting, like fishing, is quite a common component to most games and makes sense to add. There's not too much more to add. To this other than you know you could make better gear possibly craft ships that would be pretty cool actually uh <laughs> but what if you could craft gear to equip to your companions sometimes you know you want to change up your companion's hat you know i don't really like this one maybe we change it up but it could add more abilities um such as an extra super strike number two for those who don't know this is the black market it's off the side of the bazaar you can trade the script for items um, such as housing items, uh, ship cabins, uh, doubloons, and equipment. But the stock is quite limited. I think they should update this, add more stuff, add possibly better stuff, who knows, um, and also add a bounty system where you can get tasks from the squid behind me to defeat and collect a whole bunch of items across the spiral and level up the shop so it, you get more items and better levels, more badges. Who knows? I think that would be pretty cool though. One, companion promotions. Companion promotions are really cool as they expand more on the backstory of each of your companions. I would really like to go, like them to go back and take the time to add proper quests for companions such as um, Catbeard and Gracie Conrad, who get a promotion at level 70, but not a quest. Yet Old Scratch, gets a promotion at level 70 which has a story all main story companions should get story promotions i would honestly prefer to not have an upgraded cat bed if we could wait longer to get a story upgrade on this note some of the companions that have been without promotion for ages should be able to be promoted soon especially those that only require gold to promote there is a crazy number of companions that haven't been promoted since around level 30 so i would say my number one most wanted update is more companion promotions thank you very much for watching i hope you enjoyed please let me know down in the comments which of my ideas you like the most and um which uh updates you would like to see leave them down in the comments below and as always thank you for watching and remember to craft outside the box